Hey, what's up? This is St. Joe, MachineTutorials.com. Just a really quick update to the video I did on how to open your projects from the machine controller. One thing you want to do is you want to protect that program or that project so you don't overwrite it. You know, sometimes you get to go in and you start saving projects. And since it's something that's already built, you could do a quick save and save over it. So what you want to do is actually write protect it. So the quickest way to do that is go to the project, open the containing folder, then go to the project and click properties. You can either go to the security tab or just go right down here and say read only. Make sure you click apply, then click OK. Now what this does is say I load my project. Say I load my project and now I go make some changes to it. I got everything going in the heat of the moment. I just click save real quick, you know, or I click shift save from the controller. Well, what's going to happen is it's going to error out. It's going to say I don't have rights to it. It's going to tell me I can't save it. So that's going to remind me to do a save as. Now if I do a save as, I can save it as whatever. And I'm good. So that way I never lose my new project. So this goes with part one when I showed you how to open up a new project from the machine controller. But this makes it so that you don't overwrite that blank project and have to keep remaking it. So basically, anytime you try to save quickly, if you forget and you try to save, it's not going to let you save over it. And you're going to be required to do a save at. So, of course, if you got any questions, let me know. This is St. Joe, MachineTutorials.com. See y'all later.